during the last decade, it changed totally our view on this uh, famous microflora which become the microbiota. Why? Because of the molecular biology and the metagenomic. And today we have another view, but it suggests that many uh, events could change the uh, crucial phase of microbiota implementation. And your question is regarding the microbiota implementation. And indeed, uh, from birth, as soon as the child is uh, crying, is already colonized, colonized by the, the, the mean of uh, the mother uh, melange, mixing feces and vaginal uh, mean. And if you have a delivery by C-section, you may change this first uh, recognition of the bacteria because the newborn is sterile and the, the first implementation comes from this mixture. But other factors are influencing the implementation. That is for you the first one. The term is also influencing the hygiene of the environment, the mode of feeding, the use of uh, some drug like antibiotics or PPI that change by, for example, suppressing the gastric acid barrier or by killing some bacteria, you may change this uh, microbiota implementation. That means that today, which is very important to consider, especially as pediatrician or neonatologist, is that as we recognize today the so-called metabolic programming, which is starting before birth, during the fetal life and after birth. But about the microbiotal, microbiotical programming, there is event just after birth, and this event should be considered. And some of this event may be avoidable, like C-section. There is evidence today that the microbiota plays a crucial role in the development of the immune system. It's highly debated, but what I like to mention is a fascinating work that has been done comparing uh, children in the same village those living in a farm and the other not living in a farm. That means that the exposure to microorganisms early in the life is different according to the lifestyle and to the location of the life. And after several years, you can see that atopic disease, asthma, allergic disease is different. And those who are living in a farm seems to be more protected than the other. That means gut microbiota, immune system is very important. The pediatrician should be more educated in considering the microbiota. It's not for making my miracle, but progressively by pointing the importance of microbiota, it's probably a chance to avoid some disorder. And by pointing the role of microbiota, it's also a, a, a way to promote the microbiota modulation by using special food, uh, high fiber food, by using dairy product, by using also uh, dairy pro product enriched in probiotics.